Hello friends, today I am going to reveal some true facts of Belladonna. The first of all, I request you to please share and subscribe my channel for getting my informative true facts videos uninterrupted. Please note that subscription of my channel is free of cost. Now, Belladonna. Common name, Deadly Night Set. Prover, Helmman, Family, Solenasi. Introduction. Bella means beautiful. Donna means lady. Beautiful lady. Venetian ladies use it as cosmetics to brighten the eyes and flush their cheeks due to the property of two alkaloids, atropine and belladonna. Hanuman was the first one who discovered its therapeutic value. It was Hanuman's deep sight which could find out the immense curative value of these alkaloids and transformed them into a marvelous medicines through the process of potentiating. Belladonna is one of the Clark's ABC nurseries, of others being Econite and Chamomilla. While Belladonna causes turmoil in brain, Econite and Chamomilla causes turmoil in circulation and temp temperament respectively. A sphere of action. Its chief center of action is cerebrum, from where it um, radiates. Influence upon the entire organism. Brain and its membranes, cardiovascular systems, heart, lungs and mucous membranes of eyes. Mouth, throat, skin, granular structure are also not spared. Pathogenesis of belladonna. Its action on brain and its mucous membranes and various organs produces a state of congestion everywhere in the body leading to inflammation, delirium, illusion, delusion and hallucination and mania. General hyperesthesia of both sensory and motor nerves resulting in congestion of blood vessel, heart and consequently affected symptoms are produced. Constitution, physical makeup, since it is an acute remedy, there is no serious importance. However, it is adapted to various plethoric persons with red face and to a condition in them of local plethora. And also, also to those having lymphatic constitution with fine complexion and delicate skin. Temperament, bilious, lymphatic and nervous temperament. Relations with heat and cold. Chili, miasma, shora in background, diathesis, tubercular, guideline, guiding symptoms, right sided medicine. Acute, sudden, and violent onset in is very characteristic of these drugs. This aspect of the symptoms. Congestion is the key note of belladonna. Congestion is the key note, key note of belladonna. Its actions on the brain. A state of active congestion is produced, resulting in furious excitement, irritability, convulsion, delirium and pain. Consequently, there is flushed face, throbbing carotids, heart and burning pulses of blood and head built delirium. Congestion causes redness of face and eyes, rush of blood to head and face throbbing of brain and carotids. Now, redness. Redness of belladonna is very characteristic arising from the congestions. There is great redness of the inflamed part, in particular and in general, all over. The skin is very red and shiny. A smooth redness of the surface occurs over the whole body. Heat. Heat is yet another peculiarity. Due to the congestion, there is great heat, especially at the congested and inflamed part. The heat is so severe that the affected part imparts a burning sensation to the examining hand and the physician is reflexively compelled to withdraw its hand. Now burning. Burning sensation is another characteristic of belladonna. Burning sensation is another characteristic of belladonna. There, there is intense burning anywhere and everywhere, both internal and external such as in skin, brain, mouth, throat, tonsil, stomach, liver, etc. Sensitivity. 
Sensitivityness to the touch of affected part is very well marked. Cannot bear to be touched anywhere. Dryness. Great dryness runs through whole of this remedy. Great dryness runs through whole of this remedy. The dryness is often associated with the heat, redness, burning and throbbing. Along with all of these symptoms, signs of inflammation, swelling or edema are also found. The affected part is swollen, shining, very red and hot and sensitive to touch. Pain. Great pain remedy. The character of which are pain comes suddenly, lasts indefinitely or goes away suddenly. Pain occurs usually in short attacks. Burning and throbbing in character of the pain with redness of the face and the eyes, flushes of the head and throbbing of carotids. Pain runs from above. The patient is very much sleepy but cannot sleep. Belladonna patients are very much entertaining, jolly, well behaved and social when they are well. Becomes very violent and often delirious when they fall sick. In Belladonna patients, sweat, if at all found, is also on the covered part. Thirst. Generally, Belladonna patient is not thirsty, especially in female. The complaint of Belladonna patients are aggravated by touch jar and motion, draught of air and heat of sun after 3 pm. Lying down and uncovering and ameliorated by rest, standing or sitting erect and in a warm room. Mind, excellent remedy for delirious condition brought on by cerebral commission. Great excitement and violence run through the whole remedy. The patient is very delirious with constant cerebral congestion. Belladonna is one of the trials of delirious remedies, other being hypo, hyposcamus and stermonium. The most characteristic feature of belladonna is a surge of blood to the brain. When throbbing of carotids, the heat, radiation, congestion of fish and conjunctiva passes away, the delirium also subsides in proportion. Belladonna may have delirium with pale face also as it is alternate, but that is an exceptional case. Rage. The patient has furious rage and anger. He, he, he spits, bites and strikes those around him. He picks up the bedclothes, tears them to pieces and throws them off. He breaks into fits of laughter and, 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 and gnashes his teeth, presenting a picture of absolute and violent insanity. The patient imagines seeing various things such as ghost monsters, hideous faces, various black animals, dogs, wolves, and dangerous wild animals. There is a great fear of unusual and imaginary things, wants to run away from them, a strange delusion, illusion and, and hallucination with the loss of consciousness. He uses absolute language and anxiety with the desire to flee, escape and hide. Elements Exposure to draught of cold air, cold wind haircut, on uncovering the head getting wet, summer complaints, taking sauces and wine. General, general modalities, aggravation, cold air and water, wet weather from washing in morning during full moon, amelioration, lying on painful side, headache, condition, exposure to cold or the heat of sun from hair cut, congestion and, uh, and suppression of cataral flow, mode of onset, sudden and violent, location, right side, supraciliar region and forehead, now sensation, as if the brain were pushed through the forehead, sensation of stabbing as by a dive from one temper to the another. Character of pain. The intense periodical nervous and congestive headaches accompanied by tense pain, pressive or vertex forehead and the rush of blood to the head with pulsation of cerebral arteries and throbbing in brain. Modalities. Aggravations from slight motion, jar, noise, light, touch, least exertions or, or leaning towards, bending to, uh, downwards or lying 
down anything that takes the patient out of the perpendicular position. Amelioration by tight bandage and during menses. Red, red face, throbbing of carotids, often with pain in the eyeballs, boring head into the pillow. Redness of eyes with a burning and great intolerance of light. Double vision, deep vision objects appear upside down. A vertigo, causation, a stooping or, or rising, rising after, a stooping or change of position. Vertigo with a falling to the left side or backward as if objects turns in a circle or sway to and, and from. A scalp is very sensitive to, to touch with the much throbbing heat. Gastro gastrointestinal tract, mouth. Mouth is very dry with with or without thirst. Tongue and palate are dark red and dry. Tremor and stammering of speech. Soft maxillary gland or swollen. Putrid test in the mouth. Throat. The great dryness of the throat and, and fosses with reddish and burning. Washed on the right side. Throat feels very much constricted with a consequent difficulty in, in difficulty in deglutitions. Tonsillitis wash on the right side. Ovalized red and swollen, very painful and burning. Stomach and abdomen, loss of appetite, aversion from meat, milk, spasmodic pain in epigastric region, nausea and vomiting, great thirst of cold water. Dates, drinking, uncontrollable uh, vomiting, abdomen, distended heart, tender swollen pain as if clutched by uh, uh, hand, worse from jars and pressure. A stitching and cutting pain and uh, left side when coughing and sneezing. A stool, thin green in lumps like a chalk, piles more sensitive with a backache, prolapse of any. Urinary. Retention, acute urinary infection, urine, urine, urine scanty with the tenacious dark and turbid with bloated phosphate the hematuria, where no pathological conditions can be found. Male, the testicles hard, inflamed, orchids, nocturnal seat on the generator's flow of prostatic fluid, desire diminished. Female, dysmenorrhea, menorrhea. Menses and then uh, are very offensive and hot. Menses increased, bright red, to uh, early to profuse, dragging pain around the lungs. Respiratory, tickling short dry uh, cough, worse at night, uh, hoarseness, aphonia. Cough with pain in left hip, uh, larynx uh, are very painful, feel as if a foreign body, barking, whooping cough. Uh, moaning at uh, every breath, fever, cogitions, uh, draught of cold air, uncovering the head, haircut, summer, shun, mood of onset, sudden and violent, symptoms, high fever state, burning pungent, uh, streaming heat, feet icy cold, uh, no thirst with fever, a skin dry and hot, sore and sensitive, burns scarlet, a smooth eruptions like uh, scleratina, suddenly spreading, glands woolen, tenders, red wires, alternate redness, paleness of the skin. General modalities, aggravation, worse motion, touch, noise, lying down, looking at bright shining the objects after 3 pm, night after midnight, while drinking, uncovering, head strong smell, amelioration, rest, standing or sitting erect in warm room, relations complementary to calcarea, Follows well to arsenic album, camphoria, hypersulfur, mark shore, followed well by dalcamara, hypersulfur, hyposcamus, lachesis, rustox, antidote, coffee, cruda, hyoscamus. In my next video, I will reveal some true facts of other more interesting topics. Thanks.